Judge, this is the case of Like a Virgin. This is a couple I thought I would never see in divorce court. Are you ready? He wants to get married, and she won't commit. If that's not new, I don't know what is. Court is now in session. The Honorable Judge Lynn Toller presiding. Good day, ladies and gentlemen. I'm here today with Emily Crodel and Bradley Hodge. The two of you have been together for two years. You have no children together, though you have several children from previous marriages. Um, your relationship is at a crossroads. I will just put that there. And Ms. Crodel, I'm going to start with you. Why don't you tell me a little bit about your relationship and why you're here to sure. see me today? Yes, I came on the show because I really, I'm 29 and mm -hmm. I'm a virgin still and I want to, I'm Catholic so that's like my belief and I, it's something that I can't change and I won't change, but every Tell day. Tell it, sister. I know. So, and every day, every single day, I'm like, what the heck? Why do I feel pressured every day? How about a little change? Never. No, no time change time at all change. because. Whoa, 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 whoa. Do, do you feel pressured by yeah, him? Yeah, all the time. And I. What the, give me the nature of the pressure. Okay, so, okay, so sometimes I should probably be better because I put myself in situations where, you know, we might be alone a lot at a house. <laughs> and then I get, like, excited. Mm. And, and then I'm like, no, I don't want to do this. But then I'm like, okay, I'm going to break up with you today. And then, it, then I'm yeah, gonna... Yeah, but this is like three times a day. It's like yeah. lunch, <laughs> breakfast, dinner. Yes. Mm -hmm. So it's like, you know, yeah, yeah, but all day, all that night, doesn't, great things. But I don't understand. Maybe I want to know if, if it's really like, oh, oh, babe, like, you're so good, you know, oh, it's in the moment, or is he just manipulating me? You're scaring me to death, <laughs> Ms. Crowder. I don't know what's going on here. Let me talk to Mr. Hodge for a second. I'll get back to you. Okay. Mr. Hodge. Yes. Tell me what your understanding is about what she wants in a relationship and why it is you two are at a crossroads. I think she likes me, possibly loves me, but what she really wants is to be a star. Which she is. So she uh -huh. is a, you know, sounds like Janice right. Joplin, she's a star, blah, blah, blah. But she doesn't know if she really wants to commit to a long-term relationship, which I've right. committed a year and a half of celibacy, which is, for a man, I think might be impossible. I'm the Guinness World of Records, mm -hmm. I don't know. Mm -hmm. The point is that, you know, I'm being patient with right. the breakup. Oh, you are. You know, I think I'm being patient, you know. Well, no, now, really... now, I do want to say that there is a disparity in age. You are 51 yeah. and you are 29. Correct. So there is some disparity okay, in age. Okay, and he lied about that. Did he really? Yes, he ish, said he was ish. 40. And then he said, no, I'm 40. That's a big ish. Yeah. We're 45 ish. He said, I'm 40. <laughs> then he said, I mean 40, like we're driving to Kentucky. Yeah, but she didn't and ask to like after like two weeks, to which she's like, and ah. I was like, Oh, and the cop came up, you know, and he, then... How did the police get involved? Because well, they kind of asked... Speeding. Well, they asked if she was my daughter. Yeah, that... <laughs> and I said, well, of course not. Right. And you know, I know little... that people say, you know, oh, you look really young for me, right? Mm -hmm. And that is kind of weird, you know, at Six Flags when people are like, is that girl kissing her dad? <laughs> that's like, <laughs> like, that's really weird. But it's okay. Because I do like you, but I, this one thing is like so important to me. And if it if it ever is going to be compromised, I it's always it seems like it's always being compromised. And so I well, need to I really gave her know. an engagement ring. Right. All right. So right. I gave her an engagement ring, promise ring, you know, yada yada yada. And I'm like, hey, I love you. You're the one. I wait a year and a half for whatever wow. we're waiting for. Right. I wait a thousand years for it. I, but then she gives you the ring back in a week. No. Saying, Did, oh, no. Do you want to marry him? Do you think he's your forever do- I don't, uh, Yes? I, I think that I don't know what to do. No, I, but, but not, not what you know what to do, not what's right, what right. your parents want. What do you feel? Like, yeah, he's, maybe, this is the guy maybe, or not? You know what? It's weird, because I, I think it's like this in me. I don't know. I just love him. Yeah. I love but... him. But what? I don't she know. She would like to know. I know. 
I, the audience would like to okay, know. Okay, I do feel like I still have to be on my own sometimes, a lot of the time, to get things done that I need to get done, especially with my oh. career and everything like that. Give me an example of, sure. of, of how you think being with him with impedes impede. on your career. Okay. This is the problem, Your Honor. She is an attention hat. Yeah, well, well let, let yeah. her finish. Let, oh, let yeah, finish. Yeah. What, yeah. How does he impede on your Right, okay. Your journey. Okay, time. It's like, whoa, what's up today? What's, you know, not today, every hour. It's like, hey, honey, hey, yeah. But not really, honey, because he doesn't call me that. But he's like, hey, <laughs> I, I, lo I love you. What are you doing? But then I'm like, oh, man, I need to get stuff done. And then we're at the movies three days in a row. And I don't know what to do. Well, you know, she is an actress. I uh -huh. make movies. Right. So she's a starlet. So, you know, I kind of like to you know, keep her around a lot and watch movies with her. Be, right. Like, out. Uh -huh. You know, at the club alone. By myself. Well, you like to hang it? out and be single. You're on yes. it. She dances till four in the morning. Maybe five. Uh -huh. Doing headstands. She can't do backflips anymore. It's like Coyote Ugly 24 7. It's a 24 <laughs> vortex. What do you mean? That's my favorite thing. Sure. Actually, I'm going to do it over here. Don't you do yes, it. I'm Emily, do don't it. you do it. I'm doing it. TV. <laughs> this is what I do. Mr. Hodge, this is who she is. 24-7, yes. like it or me, not. Right? But I'm saying to I... you, this is who she is. Do you want this or do you want something that looks like this that that is altered to fix, fit your life? Well, I want your version. I, no! <laughs> Say what you want to me. My version? I, I don't know because What's my I, version? No, I think the ideal version is to tone it down a little bit. Like the example, we May went to the wedding. We went to a wedding, okay? We're at the wedding. Okay, it's someone else's time to enjoy their marriage, you know? Slow dance, right. sing, mm -hmm. dance, right, you know? Right. Well, she gets a little disrespectful. No. She kind of grabs the mic. <laughs> From the bride. <laughs> uh, yes, her? they're dancing. Now it's funny. Yeah. She knew the bride and starts this singing her song. own songs. <laughs> then caresses the band to hit a beat then they that matches they her it. song. Okay, okay. The whole wedding party was like, hey, hey, Crotal, yeah. Miss Crotal, please help me out. Please help me out. So I'm just trying to see one, is she really a virgin? You know, that's kind of like, you know. Is you that walk important? Water too? No, it's not this important. Just, you know, I didn't want to be like the last, you know. Guy to find out. So, sure enough, sure enough, she is a virgin. I am. Which is probably even scarier. Yeah, no. At that point, you're like, this oh, is... eggshells, you know, mm -hmm. what can I do, what can I do? It's just sometimes Just, you need to tone it down. Right, right, right. Yeah, yeah, what, what, is what is that? Sometimes you need to tone it down. Okay, you know, just Dad. A little, uh, yeah. Like, you, yeah, you know what I mean? Like, what the heck? What is this thing with your eye, your eyebrows? Do you know? It's like sometimes you need to <laughs> okay. tone it down. <laughs> Isn't that I think it's more like, oh. no, don't do that. I'm totally embarrassed. You're oh, wait, I'm leaving town. Where's the key? <laughs> leaving you behind because you're embarrassing. That's what's wrong. No. You're Am totally I embarrassing? embarrassing. Well, Miss 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 Yo Miss Craig Miss Crotal Miss Crotal Miss Crotal Miss Crotal. Sorry. Sorry. You say that he's incredibly jealous. Why don't you tell me about okay, that? Okay. So one time we were in Chicago. Right. Okay. Maybe there were some cool people on the dance floor. Maybe. And this one particular person maybe a male person, was dancing. Right. So I'm on the dance floor. It's not even long. Maybe like three minutes long, right? We're like, hey. <laughs> and then all of a sudden, it's like, <clears throat> you know, come here. Like, let's go. Right, right. And it's like, man, well, I can't even Well, the thing is, she flirts with everybody at the, at the, at the She club. flirts with everybody? Everybody. Right. Women, too. I, I find that believable. I, I mean, I, you I, know, I, I find that believable. I kind of do, too. 
All right, I know. I'm glad you say that he, you've caught him going through your phone several I times. Have. What's what, what's that all about? What is that about? I okay. Shall we ask him? Shall we ask him, Mr. Hodge? What's that about? Well, I didn't know if I was her <laughs> ninth or tenth boyfriend at the time when I first started dating her because it was very a year later. Uh, well, not a year later, like three months. Mm -hmm. like, so but like, anyway, so I'm just trying to see one: is she really a virgin? You know, that's kind of like you know. Is you that walk important? Water too? No, it's not this important. Just, you know, I didn't want to be like the last, you know, guy to find out. So, <laughs> sure enough, sure enough, she is a virgin. I am. Which is probably even scarier. Yeah, no. Because at that point, you're like, oh, is... eggshells, you know, mm -hmm. what can I do, what can I do? Everyone oh, with a virgin. that is hard, I guess. But, yeah. Uh, the thing that's weird. Take your clothes off. No, can't, not till 2050. So yeah. that's what I'm like looking at. <laughs> But what is this in Dear my... Dear Jesus. Okay, Why we're sleeping last night. What? That is important. See? I know, I know. And so maybe I'm just confused because I... Because you seem so beautiful sometimes. Thank and you. And then sometimes at night you're like, take off your clothes. Well, like, that's the other me. That, that see, lives what is in a that? Cave. You can't have two yous. Yeah, I can't. Is what I'm you. saying, Judge. Well, she's awful pretty and charming, so, you know. Judge, help. <laughs> what do you want? I, I need to help because I'm not good at confrontation at all. And, and... Well, what do you want me to confront him about? I, um, I guess whether I need to go or not, whether I can... Miss Crotal, let me say this to you. Let me say this to you. Miss Crotal, Miss Crotal, Miss Crotal, let me say this to you. Sorry. When are you going to commit to thrift? You say you want to marry me. I say yes. Mr. Hobbs. You don't? Let me say this to you. A woman who doesn't want to commit, set her free. You don't need a man's permission for nothing. You don't need to confront him. You don't need to persuade him. You don't, you don't have to do nothing. He's a stranger to you. Till right. you're married. Now, uh -huh. I make adjustments for my husband of 30 years because okay. we're in it to win it and we're committed to each other wow. and he spent his life with me. Okay. But this dude has not done that yet. And you're not there. So don't, you, you, don't, you, you don't have to please him. You don't have to give him what he needs and give him what he wants because you're not there yet. No, right. I think you're a wonderful dude. <laughs> I got nothing against you. Thank you. This is, just, this is just my, right. my, 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 my... I needed to... I was going to say it. 10 cents, but I'm going to say $20 million opinion <laughs> about how women need to view themselves wow. as individuals unto themselves. Wow. You're not either a virgin or not a virgin. Yeah. You're not defined by whether a man has entered yeah. you or not. You are defined by what you, you think, what your yeah. mind is about, about your spirit, your wow. soul. If you've decided not to share your body with no, that you don't ever have to do it. Yeah. Ever, ever, ever. Yeah. And you never have to tell anybody what your sexual status is. Wow. Nobody, it's nobody's business who's been in there or not. Right. Nobody's. Yeah. Nobody's. That's amazing. I needed I'm just to hear saying, that so much. Sorry, I know I'm working at cross purposes to you, but that's what I truly, if she was my daughter, that's what I would tell her about being a woman, is it's not defined by your relationship to any given man or if wow. a man has touched you or not. Wow. That's, that's, well, Yana, that's we're not here bucky. about wow. her virginity. That's not the biggest issue. The issue is commitment. You know, one, she's on, next day she's going to, she's not committed. And that's the reason we're here, is to say, but when are you going to commit to the rest of You say you want to marry me? I say yes. Mr. Hyde, you you let me say this to you. <laughs> A woman who doesn't want to commit, set her free. Yeah. And I'll tell you why. We women are hard on locking a dude down. We, I get women here and here all the time. Judge Lynn, if you could just get me a ring. He could, he's cheating on me. He won't work. He plays video game. But Lord, Judge Lynn, if you could just get me a ring. Women are silly with it. Yeah. <laughs> And you don't want to push a woman into a commitment if that's not where she is. You know what I'm saying? And she's not sure she can be pure crotal <laughs> attached <laughs> no. to you. Yeah. And there's a whole lot of crotal going on over there. Lots of and, 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 and I respect your ability to hang in there because there's a lot. I mean, I've only been out here 15 minutes. I'm looking to go home right now. <laughs> 
Yes, I respect <laughs> your, I respect your thing. And not only that, my man, I respect the fact that you respected the fact that she didn't want to have sex with you. Yeah. I think you could have got her drunk. You could have pushed. You could have, you know, all this, you know, the whole bunch of stuff dudes can do to get it. And you didn't do it. And I respect that about you. Thank you. And you, you know what I mean? Yeah, yeah. You're a great dude. I'm going to tell you something, though. When you leave here, our inbox is going to fill up. And it's going to be a bunch of women saying, if she don't want to give it to him, I will. (laughs) I'm telling you that. I'm just telling you. That's not a warning. What I said to you still stands. Now, you guys said you were in here fighting over some some stuff, but y'all ain't interested in your stuff, are you? Uh, you know, the stuff. Artwork? Yeah, that I painted Paintings? a little bit. No, I think that's just... Uh, n- well, You're the- not leaving that man. You're not. You wouldn't be this, this agonized over all... Ooh, that's beautiful. Did you do that? Yes. That's gorgeous. Hey, I didn't know what you were looking at. Yeah, there's that's absolutely one, beautiful. That's did all, you give those to him? Yes, I did. Yeah, They're at his house. Oh, man, you're talented. Thank you. Very, very Take talented. Taking the Jets, that was that one, because it's Elton John's. If but you're, you're not going nowhere. You like him. I know. You're just not sure. You don't have to make a decision. All right. You know what I mean? Yeah. I got guys in here drag women around for 10 years. What? I'm not yeah. suggesting that, because I like you. Yo, you did 15 and a year and a half. It's only no, right, You know, but... but is but, it fear of loss, or is it real? That's... You know, when you're ready, you're ready. It won't be a struggle when you're ready. You know what I mean? It By won't that? be a struggle when you're ready. I'm telling you. Yeah. And, you know... 20, 27, 29 years, I met this dude. Wow. I never dated a guy more than nine months. Me but either. when I met the one that I got now, it was like, oh, there he is. <laughs> <laughs> wow. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. You'll know when you know. You know when You'll you know. You'll be ready. And it might be him. Did you it's know? It's just that you're not ready. Yeah. Did, were you like that at first? And then you... Decide? What do you mean? Like, like what? Like, I, no, I mean... Did you do headstands? No. <laughs> When you saw your husband, did you do headstands? I did a headstand in the family room last week. Well, there you go. That's amazing. I really got Headstands, cartwheels, still do them. Here's, mo- here's what I have to say to you. Dating is when you overlook a woman's weird. <laughs> Marriage is when you ride her weird with her. You gotta decide if you wanna ride her weird. The dude I got rides my weird with me. I do handstands, cartwheels, talk to myself, he walks through the room, don't even notice. (laughs) So what you have to decide is, can you ride her weird just like it is? (laughs) Not dialed back, not tamped down, not made a little less weird, but can you ride it the way it is? I wish I, you both luck, and yeah, you'll know when you'll know you're a good dude. Until then, yeah. this matter is adjourned. <laughs> Can this work? I mean, Judge Lynn had a lot to say today. What, what's your take you on it? You know what? I think she had a lot of good advice. Uh-huh. But it's, I do uh, too. it's it's a work in motion. And you're, you're willing to wait this out? Yeah, I've been on the ride for a year and a half. I mean, That's I could wait a little cool. longer. I'm buckled up, right? I'm buckled <laughs> up sometimes. Uh-huh. Sometimes I'm buckled up. <laughs>